Let's expand and simplify 1 minus x squared, or 1 minus x to the second power. It's probably easiest to think about this as just 1 minus x times 1 minus x. It's the same thing, but now we can use the distributive property to expand and simplify 1 minus x squared. So let's use this one here. What we're going to do is we're going to take this 1 and multiply it by 1 and then by negative x. Then we'll take negative x, multiply it by 1, and then negative x here. So we're just distributing these across this expression here. We can use the FOIL method to make sure we get that straight. The first term, we'll multiply those, so 1 times the 1 here. That just gives us 1. Then we can do the outside terms. That's the 1 and the negative x. 1 times negative x, that's just negative x. For the inside terms, we have negative x here times 1, that's negative x, and then for that last term we have the negative x times negative x. Negative times negative is positive, since it's x times x, we'll have positive x squared. These two terms are similar, let's just combine those, and we have 1 minus 2x plus x squared. Often you'll see this written like this here, just kind of the reverse, x squared minus 2x plus 1. It's the same thing, just written with the x squared term first. This is Dr. B expanding and simplifying 1 minus x squared. Thanks for watching.